management plus uh, mall operator plus uh, mall owner company which is based out of UK and uh, it has got 20 outlet centers in uh, Europe and UK. Uh, it is now looking at footprints in East uh, uh, part of the world. Now why Freeport Retail is so required here? Every business has its course. It matures, it, it begins, it kind of develops and it matures and then it dies. Every every uh, business has that cost. So in the um, retail business now is the time to have outlet centers. Now what are outlet centers? So outlet centers is when you have matured retail where people start understanding brands and brands have so much to speak to the customers, so much to offer to the customers that every season they have something new. So season minus one has to express somewhere. So what happens is, see the season minus one is those stock which is lying in their uh, warehouses waiting to be acknowledged and converted into cash. So Outlet Centers handles that and resolves and brings cash back in the system. Which is why now India retails for the survival of the retail, for the survival of so many brands, we need that season minus one to express itself in a very, very good manner so that the brand presence is not diluted. When people come to Adidas, they should have the same, whether outlet or full priced, they should have the same experience. They should feel that they've come to a very, very high end mall and they should have the same brand experience, which is why we should have international quality of outlet malls and Freeport is there to help them. My mall is coming up in Manisar. It is on the highway. It's known as Tomorrowland because it is the future of retail and uh, it, we are going to, we intend to open next Diwali. When we have a full priced mall, we generally have a 10 to 15 kilometers radius, uh, which we call as the catchment. Catchment for outlet center is far more. We draw, dry, uh, means we take the, as the uh, center of uh, the mall, outlet center, we draw a radius of around 70 kilometers. So my area is Noida, Gurgaon, Delhi, Rajasthan, Everywhere people can come because they sniff deals. So which is why outlet centers are very popular and they are always on the outskirts of the city. We don't intend to do any competition to the full price retail. And also we trying to kind of increase the brand influence and give them more customers who can experience them. It's as big as six lakh GLA. Uh, which will be in phases, three to four we'll open in first phase and then we'll expand to six. We can't do anything without technology. The very fact that I'm speaking to you is also technology. So uh, technology will be used because brands will have to speak to the customers. Uh, they will have to speak to me because most of them will also have some ref share. And we also will uh, study the customer behavior and technology will be, you know, I hate talking to machines and I'm sure my customers will also hate talking to machines. So barring direct communication where the customer meets the customer, uh, we will have technology supporting us. F&B is a very, very uh, important uh, aspect of uh, outlet retails because they are in very, very far off places. People who come here spend the entire day. So F&B is going to be at least 30 to 40 percent F&B, uh, right from the coffee shops to you no know, fine dine though. But uh, most of them will be uh, all day dining because uh, being in outskirts, we don't expect people to stay for long. So say uh, after 8.39, I don't expect a lot of footfalls but from the morning to evening we will be having all day time. You name the brand and it will be there. Uh, I believe if the brand is not expressing itself in outlet centers means the brand is not offering new to its customers. Uh, so every brand, every international brand, every Indian leading brands are already showing interest and uh, is going to be there. So uh, parking is something which I'm paying a lot of heat to because people will drive and come to ease of parking will be there and uh, normally whatever foot, full price mall offer parking we will have three times more because uh, people in, will be coming for longer periods and will park for longer periods so say if a mall requires 6000 uh, car parks we will have just double of that.